Hey, this is Dave, and I'm with my brother Rich. We're at the Lake House again today, and today we're going to show you how to install an OD uh, laundry, uh, they call it laundry outlet box, and it's where it's for the drain and your supplies all are in one box, and uh, we've got the plumbing where we need it, and we're just going to show you final connections and give you an idea of uh, how to do it. We're doing it with PEX. Our, we're making our, line, our plumbing supply lines with PEX. All right, so these are our supply lines, and these come all the way from the basement where our mana block is. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to run the supply lines up and over and down to the top of the box. The OD box allows you either to come from the top or from the bottom, but because we already the plumber uh, already had cutouts here on these non-supporting good thing uh, two by fours, uh, we're going to run the hex lines over here so they can be behind the drywall. And then we'll come straight down like that. And this is our two inch drain. And at least you can see how, how the plumbing actually works. We got a, our two inch drain with the trap and it comes over here to our main drain for the upstairs. This is the second floor laundry. And then this right here is our vent pipe and it vents, the, there's a bathroom behind here as well. And so it's part of the, part of this side of the bathroom is vented on, on this side. So, that's kind of what we're left with. So all we have to do now is basically attach the plumbing, which is down here. This is our, um, this is the plumbing uh, drain, and it's gonna come up to here to the, where the box is, and the box is gonna be right there. And so we, we just gotta make our final connections with that, and then bring our supply lines down, and we'll be good to go. And all we gotta do now is go ahead and prime this final, or uh, out, glue this final piece. and we'll be ready to test fit the box. So we're gonna test fit the box here, and that's where we want it, and it's gonna fit fine. There's a knockout plug here that we're gonna knock this out uh, real gently, and then we'll glue the box on, and then we'll attach our supply lines. There, there's two ways of doing this. You're, it, you can have your drain here and your valve on either side if your plumbing is coming from underneath. But we're flipping this box, so our our supply valves are gonna, they have these, uh, um, out dents, whatever. So you can go ahead and lock them in and see, and then it locks in. And so we're gonna supply from the top, but again, we want our drain to be at the bottom. And so it has this little plug right here and we gotta take that out. And to do it, to remove this plug, we got a real fine screwdriver, and what we're doing is basically hitting it on that seam all the way around here till, till we can knock that plug out. Now, if the yours was already installed, let's say you had a plumber do it, it's already installed, and you get your washing machine delivered, and you find out he didn't knock out the plug. Um, if it's already up there, you don't want this plug going down into your drain, obviously. So what you would do is take this, Take the screwdriver and go around this thing about three quarters of the way and then pry it up so that this doesn't get knocked down into the drain. So we're just gonna go ahead and, ours is a lot easier because it's already out. So we don't have, run any risk. And so I'm just gonna go in and just making lots of little breaks in that seal, that ring until it wants to come out. We knocked out the plug from the box, and we're just gonna give it a one more final look here before we glue it on. And I, got, I still have to put purple primer on there. And once I get that on, I will be ready to cement it on. There we go. And that's it, we're good to go. We have our valves and these go in pretty easily. And they, they lock in, and you hear that click, you know you're good. The hot water always goes to the left. And you know, they only go one way, there we go. 
All right. Installing the pipe um, supports so that these stay in a nice fixed position. Okay, so there's the the final plumbing in to our valves and we made the final connections, the box to the PVC drain. And so we're good to go. It's not uh, too terribly complicated. Just You just need to know, are your, are, is your plumbing supply gonna come from the top or is it gonna come from the bottom? And then you can put your box in accordingly. All right, last but not least, uh, be sure and check for leaks. You turn on your water supply after you close close the valves here. You can see you can even see if they're open or closed or not. And then uh, yeah, just go ahead and check for leaks. And after it's all good, like you can see here, all we have to do next is to button it up. Okay, that's all there is to uh, installing a laundry outlet box. Hope this helps in your project. If you got anything out out of this, give us a thumbs up. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time.